Good evening, everybody. Thank you for stopping by Healing Conversations with Z. I'm Zuri Bibi or Rita, and I'm back. I think I've been gone about a week. I had to do some things. Um, I, if you watched the last video, I talked about mom having to be gone. Mom's gone. She had to go. My voice is much better. I'm not sneezing and hacking and coughing. and Oh, it was bad. Um, I felt... The message that I was given by one of my friends was that she was trying to take my life. She was trying to suck my life. And I kid you not, since that urn had been here, I had been sick and it was just bad. And then, you know, the night that I, when I got the message in my email and I looked at it and I laid in, I was laying in the bed and I was like, all this stuff I'm doing, my mother was doing. My mother was, I was in the bed. I had tissue all over. I had a bag with t It was bad. I was like, wait, wait, wait. That was a tower moment for real. I was like, oh, no. She got to go. And that's what happened. Um, was it yesterday? No, it wasn't yesterday. It was two days ago. Mom went to another relative. And it's funny because, you know, for my people who are, um, clear audience and all that kind of stuff when I got in my vehicle and I kid you not if I had enough subscribers I would post the page post the picture that I took the song by the expressions Curtis Mayfield a man was playing I, I kid you not when I got in, I put her in the back seat turned on the car and a man was playing I swear, I swear it was. And then, once I dropped her off at the relative's house, and I got back in the car, the song, I'll Always Love My Mama, came on. And I kid you not, that was the song that we played at her memorial, when we had her memorial back in November. I kid you not. So, mom is where she need to go. Um person who told me you know I told another relative what I was experiencing and they told me that she needed some weed and some liquor and I don't know what else and I was like well I don't do this I don't do none of that stuff over here so I took her where she can have that stuff and then she can have she can she can be all right so she is at that location where they do those things I don't do those things <laughs> I had to laugh about that but anyway, I want to, um, since we've gotten that out the way, I want to ask for protection for this reading. Oh, and I saged my room and smoked it out and did, I did everything that I was told to do. And I said the Lord's Prayer on top of it. Anyway, but let's go back to uh, asking for protection for this reading. I'm asking for the divine to come into this space. I'm asking for him to bring his angels and to cover me wing to wing from head to toe. Um, and then I want him to burn off. Before they cover me, I want them to, him to burn off or her. I want the divine to burn off any negative energies that may be affecting me in any way, shape, and form. My health, my mind, my soul, my body, my finances. Um, how I, you know, my emotions, everything. I want, I want him to burn off anything that's negatively affecting those things, and anything that I might not have even thought about. I'm asking for that to be burnt off of me. Um, and then after they cover me wing to wing, I want the divine to cover me again with the white light of protection, and I want it from the top of my head, the sole of my feet, left, right, front, back, and every direction and extended 20 feet and because i know that my body is the vehicle for my soul i want another layer of protection of that white light top bottom left right front back and anywhere and shaping for everywhere cover me again and extend it another 20 feet now my spirit team my animals my gargoyles my aliens my dragons my ladybugs Foxes, owls, birds, other birds, mermaids, unicorns, 
everybody, all my spirit team. I want all my spirit team to be included, along with the ancestors, the ascended masters, um, everybody that is of the light, of the light, to be included with me into this space. And, and I'm asking that whoever comes to this reading, that they be afforded the same level of protection that I'm asking for for myself. It is so, it is said, it is done. All right, five minutes and 30 minutes in. Um, I want to ask, I, I got this deck in my hand. I guess I'll use it for a second. Um, I'm asking for, um, what's going on? What's going on with y'all? Spirit, tell me what's going on with the collective. Not with me, but the collective. What, what, what do they need to focus on? And I'm using... The um the witch's deck. What is this called? Everyday witch. No, this isn't. This yeah, this is everyday witch. Cause I got a couple of witches decks. This is everyday witch. Um, I'm just gonna pull a card. I wasn't gonna use this deck, but it's in my hand. So apparently something's supposed to be happening with this deck. Um, what does the collective need to go? Need to know. Need to go. Okay, what's that about? I caught that. Nine of Cups. Some type of offer. Alright, who getting the offer? What's the message? Okay, I got a few that fell out and I'm just going to take those and then go, go from there with the other deck. Um, <clears throat> somebody's putting something to rest. Healing. Here's the Wheel of Fortune. The Eight of Wands. And the Hangman. So. The Wheel of Fortune and the Hangman. These are two major arcanas. And that's really important. So. Somebody's fortune. They're, they're at the top of the wheel. And they're getting messages really quickly so they need to start looking at things in another way don't think that you're stuck you got to look at think take things and look at them from a different perspective i'll clarify the will of fortune we got the knight of swords it's happening fast charging forward Some type of judgment concerning Ten of Cups. So it's a family situation. Somebody's family is um, receiving judgment. Somebody's angry. Somebody's angry because they've received some type of judgment in a family in a family dynamic. Look at that. And there's the truth. And there's the emperor. But I, I'll pull them out. There's the emperor. So somebody's emperor has, um, it's the truth. And somebody's sad. Somebody in their emotions. Okay. <clears throat> um, eight of Wands happening fast. Fast movement, fast messages from the divine. Somebody's being told to put something to rest. You are protected. Seven of Wands. Something about a relationship. You need strength to do whatever it is. You're getting messages to put something to rest. You need to put a relationship to rest? I don't know. Something about stability. So this can go. Oh, here's the Empress. Empress, you being told to put something to rest. Put something to rest so that you can move toward toward something you love or someone you love and become stable. Empress. 
Taurus. Taking it. Release a burden. Some kind of burden you're carrying that you don't need to carry. So you need to look at it from a different perspective. And this came, man. Ace of Pentacles. When you look at things from a different perspective, you'll get a gift <clears throat> along with a gift from uh, Ace of Cups, too. High Priestess, you have an inner knowing about this. You have an inner knowing about this. It's in reverse. And you're not in your head about it either. Whoa. Something from your past. Something from your past. Manipulation. Some type of manipulation. I, I have a question about that judgment. What kind of judgment is this emperor getting? What is this judgment about? Some type of tower. He's understanding something or she, they're understanding something. That was the truth. What was it? Something when they were, something to do with money. King of Pentacles. Something that he that he was going toward that he thought was his path that he thought was good news. But all it did was make him unbalanced. Okay. Passion. So somebody must have been slipping and sliding. Ducking their head. That's that's what this card is to me. All right. Um, <clears throat> I wasn't trying to do this kind of reading, but we'll keep it. Um, I'm done with that. That's something from the past. <clears throat> um, I guess we're getting two readings out of this. All right. Let's put this away because I wasn't trying to touch this deck. But somebody, apparently somebody needed to hear that. And this King of Cups popped up. So they're emotional, but they don't want to show it. They still on this King of Pentacles kick. Whatever that's about. But anyway. Um, we pulling out the hoodoo deck. Because, like I said, the stuff that I was dealing with. I'm sure somebody else was dealing with that stuff too. But this was the reading that I wanted to do. And so this is what I'm going to do. Um, what else does the collective need to know? I forgot to look at the bottom. Poverty. Poverty. Let me flip it over. Poverty is on the bottom. Somebody's feeling lack. They're at home. Lovers is on the bottom, so some kind of decision was made. It's reversed for me, so some kind of courtship has ended. Some kind of change is happening. There's this poverty again. They don't want to work at work on something. It's on reverse. Message of concern. So somebody's concerned. And by doing something about great fortune is on the bottom. <clears throat> So, me getting this, <clears throat> somebody's at home. There's some type of relationship that has ended. 
and they're feeling lack in some way, shape, and form, and they're concerned about it. Um, before I cut the deck, here's the Eight of Wands again. This is this is messages. This may be a continuation of the first reading. All right, <clears throat> I'm going to ask, what's going on with this family room? All right, another tower moment. Somebody's understanding something. <clears throat> a decision that they went into has gotten them stuck. And they're trying to figure out some kind of way <clears throat> to get out of it. Because it's causing a lot of heartbreak. <clears throat> I like this glass. Um, it's a family dynamic. Ten of, ten, this is ten of coins, so this is money. Somebody made some decision concerning money. So, this courtship in reverse, what is that? Four coins, something to do with money. They ended the relationship, but it was about money. Somewhere... Sh hidden it was hidden things going on with money wow okay wait 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 we're not judgment we're not taking those so somebody's going within They didn't see something spiritually. They were not using their spiritual eyes. That's why her eyes are dotted out. Something about money, and they're receiving judgment about it because they didn't look at. They didn't use their spiritual eyes. They didn't use their intuition about it. But there's some type of hope. Um, what was it? I'm being nosy now. What's the judgment? Here we go. Slipping and sliding, ducking and hiding. Something they were passionate about. Oh. Something that they were passionate, that they thought was going to be good news. That they, gam they took a gamble on something. But they had an inner knowing that they shouldn't have done it. But they ignored it. They didn't use their spiritual eyes. And so now they have a burden. They're carrying a burden. Or they're trying to release a burden. Because they ain't, this poverty, look, poverty. What's going on with this? Devil energy. You're not really, nobody's ever poor. You're manipulated to make you think you're poor or you're lack. You have everything you need. But this person was juggling. This part, whoever, whoever, they were juggling. And look, they got somebody waiting outside, ten of knives. They got backstabbed at the church. This is somebody outside the church where they got stabbed outside the church. So it was a lot of um, mental manipulation going on. And emotional as well, because that's King of Cups. Anything else? Oh, okay. Somebody walking away, though. Somebody walked away. Somebody walked away. They're walking because they've, they've made a decision or they've changed, they, they're they making a decision or they know that they had made a bad decision with this card. What are they walking towards? Okay, a lot fell out, but I'll take them. By walking away, they're going to have a new beginning financially. 
and emotionally. And they're also going to be more responsible because of the hidden things, hidden emotions, things that they didn't know. They, they're going to learn about that because they've ended some things. You know, you, you end things and then you transform. They're transforming. So what is this message of concern? Message of concern is whoever they walked away from now, they're in lack mentality. Five of coins. Somebody else is in lack because they whoever did it, some they allowed someone to get them in that energy. Because they're going somebody's going to reunite, reconcile with someone else. But the person who's concerned is because it was a three they were part of a three party situation that's what it, that's what this was about somebody stepped out and found out the hard way yeah they um now they're they're sad lack mentality sad trying to work trying to start some more mess up With the King of Coins, somebody's mad at the King. This is this is this is the same story, <clears throat> but there's going to be some justice. There's going to be some justice from this, and a cycle will end. A cycle will end for someone. These other cards are sticking out, so I'm going to take them. Um, and because this cycle is ended and they're receiving some type of justice, somebody is in their head about it. And here's this uh, King of Cups. Someone's going to be emotionally um, uh, right back. They're going to be getting back to who they really are. Some more. They're releasing a burden. Somebody's releasing the burden and somebody else has been given. Somebody's burden has been put back on them. And that is the hope by the ancestors. The hope that that can um, be rectified. And there's the king of um, wands. Somebody's gaining, regaining their confidence about this situation. And by doing all of this, they're going to have great fortune. I'm going to ask about that. Look at that. It's going to be a great fortune for a wealthy man after he ends something. Somebody going to be in despair in the dis dis distant horizons. And it's going to have a lot of people. This man is in concern. And this person, these, these, this community is concerned. This is a family because they are becoming official can't make it up um any other message that you want to say before we end this i'll take them all they all fell out and i'm going to take them so <clears throat> somebody is using their intuition and um gaining their they opening their spiritual eyes so they're going to because before they weren't before they weren't so somebody's going to be working with spirit And they're going to be around people who are fighting them, but they will be able to fight for what they want. Um, even though people are coming at them, they're going to be able to defend themselves. Because they're taking some type of action on a decision concerning a relationship. And it's the truth. This is the truth. And they're going to be victorious in doing so. This is one of my favorite cards of the day. Here's the King of Swords. Yep, because he said it's some bull. <laughs> I like he that's how he looks to me. I like him. Yep, so this is what some somebody is doing the work. Alright, you all. I'm getting ready to shut it down. Um I've been manifesting a lot of stuff. I'm in a job that I'm making good money, but I think I, I found another job that I made double my money. We'll see.
see if I want to do that. You see, it, the divine has been nudging me to do stuff. I, like I said, I manifest in 3D. I don't manifest, I don't do it here. I manifest out in the real world. So, um, just that's just something for you all to know. Because um, I know a lot of times people wonder with these readers, you know, how they, what, how do they get their money? Some do, some manifest here because they got a lot of readers and they get all this stuff and they get paid by YouTube. I'm not at that level yet. And if I get there, it's cool. I, and if not, I, it's cool too because I get mine out, out in the real world. So um, I'm hoping this reading, these both two readings have, have helped someone. I'm sure it has. Um, please leave in the um, messages, you know, comment section, you know, if it has. And um, I want to thank the person about what they told me and I did it. And your girl is back on track. And I'll see you all later. All right. Thanks for stopping my healing conversations with Z. Peace.